Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Now I know I think I said in a previous video that I was going to split up my subscriptions, but I thought I would keep them separate for now unless you guys want me to do just one video a month with all my subscriptions and kind of do a battle. But this month I did get two of these because they had two on sale for this month and I thought that I would share with you guys. And that is the Target beauty box i believe these retailed for about seven dollars i'll leave the price down below about how much i paid for it but there were two boxes this month obviously it's still sealed i have not gone through them let me backtrack a little bit on how i learned about the target beauty box i follow a blog called nouveau cheap i'll leave a little i'll leave the url right here and i'll leave it down in the description below i have been following that blog for years and it's everything that has to do with discounts and makeup, a lot of drugstore makeup, and I love that blog. I highly suggest checking it out. Every month, the owner of that blog always posts about the Target Beauty Box and when it goes on sale. She also includes the products that are in there, but I never really look at it anymore because, in all honesty, I'll probably always get it. I may glance at them, but I just don't put any stock in it. So I thought that, you know, I'd let it be a surprise while i open them up right now i think i'll start with the first one i unboxed and i don't know what's in there so when you open the lid ooh, the first thing that i get is like a scent like a very citrus scent so the first thing when you open the box you see this pamphlet it says hello sunshine summer's in full swing and we like to keep our beauty routine easy peasy inside this box you'll find a few of our faves to keep your glow going all month all to keep your glow going all month long they be knowing. I see you, Target. Mm hmm Try them out, and if you love them as much as we do, find the full-size version at Target.com slash Beauty Box. And on the back, it always gives the name of the product and a $3 off coupon code for Target that I never use ever. I'm so bad at it. And I was at Target the other day. So as always, they put it in some nice tissue paper. And when you unwrap it, these are all the products inside Ooh, i'm excited so the first thing on top of the box is the mask bar soothing sheet mask it says it's a skin moisturizing treatment that helps hydrate and soothe your skin for a healthier looking complexion i think they included a mask in the last box that i haven't used i have so many masks that i have to get through so i'll try to get around to this i love anything that's soothing i think i'll keep this though and wait till like the summertime when I start tanning because while I don't really get burned, my skin does get sensitive since I am of a lighter complexion. So I think I'll hold on to this uh, for one of those days when I'm really out in the sun and my face just needs it. But I protect my face. Ladies, I can't stress enough. Sunscreen is importante. You need sunscreen. Speaking of sunscreen, the next thing that I see is the Hawaiian Tropic Island Sport Ultra Light High Performance Sunscreen in 30 SPF. I love the Hawaiian Tropics. I have another sample. I think I have a couple. I love the scent. It's very coconutty. It doesn't really smell like sunscreen and it's, you know, lightweight. I love sunscreen. Um, cute. Ooh, I love it. That's what I think I smell was a coconut. Oh, I love the scent. So I would definitely get use out of this in the summer. The next thing that I see is, ooh. This is interesting. This is the NYX Gotcha Covered Concealer Waterproof in the shade Medium. Now, of course it's taped because why make my life easy? Wow. All right. Okay, it wasn't that it wasn't that hard to open. I was over exaggerating. Oh, maybe I wasn't. No, I was over exaggerating. I, I really was. Okay. Let me see what it looks like. Oh, it's a nice, it's a nice full-size sample. This is what the box looks like. Let me, let me test it because it says medium. 50 shades of beige, people. Medium, what does that mean? What does that mean? So this is what the medium shade looks like. I just put a pea-sized amount. Hmm, it may be a little, it may be a little too dark. And I think it's a little too dark. Maybe it's like skin tone. It's not dark. It's just my skin tone. I don't think I'd highlight with this. And it's actually pretty heavy. So. 
the jury's still out on this. I think it's a nice product to get in the box, don't get me wrong. But I don't think I'll get much use out of it because it's a little thick. And in the summer, I don't want anything thick on my face. The next thing that I see is the John Frieda Beach Blonde Sea Waves Sea Salt Spray. Let me smell this. It's not my favorite scent. I sm I've had some sea salt sprays that smell amazing. This is what it looks like. It's a nice sample, especially when you go to the beach and your hair is wavy and you want to kind of give it that beachy wave. I love taking those for that, obviously. My hair is kind of straight. I like my hair straight. The next thing in the box that I see is the Sinful Colors Nail Polish in the shade what is this? Island Coral. This is a beautiful coral shade. I would probably never use it because I only do gel on my hands and on my toes. But I like collecting nail polish. I know that's weird even though I never use them. But it's a, it's a nice coral. And it's also a color I would never wear. I mean, technically, this green is a color I would never wear. But I don't really like bright colors like that. I like kind of muted, weird colors, if you know if you know what I mean. Oh, this, this, oh. I like this. I like this. This is the Aussie 3-Minute Miracle Moist Deep Conditioner. And it's a little keychain pouch. It's the keychain packet one. I love this. I used this way back in the day. Like, way back in the day. Let me smell. Um, when I came, I think back either from college or when I was coming back from Australia, I couldn't really afford the uh, macadamia, you know, that big, like, famous macadamia hair mask. I just couldn't afford it. I was a broke college student. So this sucker is like three or four dollars and I could afford it and it works just as bomb. I love this stuff. I'll continue to keep using it and I like the little sample size. It's cute. It's cute. Target, how did you know, boo, that I needed this? You you read my mind. You knew I needed a razor. Oh. There's nothing I like more about these subscription boxes than getting a razor because if there's anything that I don't like to buy more than brushes, it is razor blades. I feel like they're way overpriced for what they are. I also don't really buy female razor blades. I tend to buy men razor blades. That's just my preference. I feel like a men a men's razor just gives like a like a closer shave. Let me know, ladies, if you use a men's razor or if you use a female's, because I want to know. I prefer men's just because I just love how it shaves better than females. I also feel like with my hair, I got that thick Puerto Rican hair on my legs, so one swipe on my legs and this is, like, gone. It will not shave anymore. It gets blunt. It's like, I think it cries when it shaves my legs. That's how strong my hair is. I wish my hair was strong on my head. Why is it strong on my legs? Dear God, answer that question. I'll be waiting. Hey God, it's Margaret. But it's actually not Margaret, it's Kayla. If you guys have read that book, put a like. So that's what I got in the first box. I thought it was an amazing deal for the price that I paid. For $7, I got a razor blade, which is like hella, hella cheap. Uh, I got a concealer, I got a mask, I got a hair conditioner, sunscreen, nail polish, sea salt spray. I've definitely products that I'll use and try. If there are any if there are any products in this box that you want me to do a review on or a demo, please leave a comment down below and I will get I will get that to you, girl. The next box doesn't really apply to me. It applies to somebody with a different type of chromosome. But I thought I would get it because why not? It's only seven, I think it was seven or five dollars. I don't know how much this one was. It might be the same price, but this is the other box again in the white packaging with the Target logo. And in this one, it's a it's more manly. And it says, Hello, Dapper Dude. I don't know about y'all, but I don't look like a dapper dude. It says, Hello, Dapper Dude. Work to work out, vacay to stay K. Inside this box, you'll find a few of our favorite grooming go-tos that'll save you some time. Try them out, and if you love them as much as we do, find the full-size version at Target.com slash beautybox. And when I open it, this is what's inside. I'm excited. 
Okay, so the first thing that I see is the Yes to Natural Man Shower to Go Cleansing Cloths. It's just cleansing cloths to remove dirt and sweat without hitting the showers. Men, please take a shower, especially in New York City. I am tired. This is a PSA. I'm gonna do a PSA in the middle of my video. I am tired of being on a hot train with no AC. MT, I'm talking about you. And then having to smell your dirty armpits. It is not the way to put some deodorant. And if you're not about the deodorant life, get some bake. Is a baking powder? And some, it's either, I think it's baking powder and lemon. Bam. Or it's baking soda and lemon. Just Google it. Google it. Because I'm, I'm, I'm tired of smelling dirty armpit. Just saying. This is not, this is not the go-to. I, by all means, try the wipes. But, um, use some deodorant. The next thing that I see is the Ol Olivina Men Hair, Face, and Body All-in-One Body Wash and Bourbon Cedar. It does have the little, you know, protector, like, hasn't been open thing. I'm not going to open it because I doubt I use this. It's probably a manly scent, and I'm not about that wave. The next thing that's in the box is this Axe Cool Charge Body Wash. I hate Axe. I despise the scent of Axe. It's just disgusting. I, no. Mm -mm -mm. Men do not. Oof. 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 No, I'm not a fan. Not a fan. The next thing in the box is the Optic White Radiant Toothpaste. I got this in the last month's box. I have so many samples of toothpaste, little like child size toothpaste. I'm like toothpaste out. But brush your teeth too, because nobody wants to smell stinky breath. Just saying. The next thing in the box is the Nivea Men Cream. I do have like the Nivea like all night bomb thing, so it's alright. This too has like a protective thing, so I'm not gonna take it off. I'll probably give this like a friend or something. And the next thing is the Dove Men Care Minerals Sage 20 no 48 hour power protection antiperspirant. They was telling you something. Target, you are shady AF. What are you trying to tell my men? They stink? I mean, by all means, you should do an ad on the train, but it's true. You need you need some antiperspirant people. Let me smell this deodorant. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna keep this deodorant for myself. <laughs> um, I love men's deodorant. There's one that uh, it's from back in the day. It's not Axe. It's like this. I'll put the name somewhere here of the men's deodorant. I love it. My my dad uses it, and um, I'm a fan. I really like the scent. I love men's deodorant. I don't know if I don't know if y'all like the men's deodorant. But I love it. I think it does a lot better than female deodorant. Just just in my opinion. And the next thing that I see that I'm hella excited about. Is the Chic Hydro 5 razor. Like. You knew. You know what? You knew I needed a razor. Child. I needed it. Now I got two razors. I'll probably give the other razors to my grandmother because she likes more female razors and they, those just do not, they do not work for me. But yeah, that's all that I got in my Target boxes. Obviously, Target doesn't do a men's box often. I know they do. They did it for Father's Day and it is currently sold out. But uh, they do a couple, I think they do maybe one more men's box in the year. I'm not, I'm not 100%. Don't take my word for it. But I like it when I do these men's boxes because sometimes men, I feel like it's hard to pick like a cologne or a perfume or a deodorant or like any type of facial body wash because us as females, we have certain needs and that's the same with men. They have certain needs. So our needs are completely different and what I like in a body wash, a man might not like in a body wash. That's just personal preference. But I really like these boxes just for the fact that they're inexpensive you are getting deluxe size samples some of these are full size samples and you're getting them from target and if you like them you can definitely go to your local target and pick them up you don't have to go to target you can go wherever they sell them amazon 
Walgreens, your local drugstores, and pick up these products. You are not bound to just go to Target. I personally like the variety of this. I feel like more people would be geared to this just because you kind of get the everyday necessities, not just makeup. You get toothpaste, you get deodorant, you get body wash, sunscreen, stuff that you don't really get in regular beauty boxes like BoxyCharm or Ipsy or stuff like that. This one is just more of a, a balance of an overall, not just not just makeup, it has skincare and hair care and just all of that. And I, I truly appreciate this box. Like I said, this one does not have any any commitment. It usually launches the first day of the month or the first Monday of the new month. I personally really love these boxes just for the price. It's no commitment. It's not like getting an Ipsy or BoxyCharm where you're bound to pay every month with your credit card. They might still be in stock. I'll link them down below. And like I said, I'll also link down the Nuvo Cheap blog down below as always i hope you guys truly enjoyed the video leave any comments questions likes anything down below don't forget to subscribe also when you subscribe hit that little notification bell so you can always be notified when i post a new video i try to be consistent also i want to know what you guys want to see because i could post about boxes all the time but if that's not what you guys are interested in then i'll post something else something that you guys really want to see as always follow me on my social media my snapchat my instagram and i'll see you in the next one Bye.